describe your emotions first getting out on the court and what that was like for you and then you know hitting that that first shot and, and, and what it meant for you after these months? It's been tough. Um, mentally, physically. I've never had to like miss out during a season for an injury before, so that was definitely new. Um, and I think with me, it doesn't take a village, it takes villages with how hard and hard headed and stubborn I am. So I mean, both my doctors, Dr. Corner, Dr. Arciero, Janelle, Pudi, our strength coach, all of our my teammates and coaches, I'm just super grateful for them and all for all they've done for me and just keeping me positive and just being there for me whenever I need them. Um, and then the first basket, <laughs> it wouldn't be me if it wasn't something extra. So I don't know, it was a lot of fun. <laughs> Paige, uh, coach talked about how the team has changed since you last played a game. Can you just talk about the difference you see in the team you took the court with uh, tonight than the last time you took the court in, in December? Yeah, I mean, the way our team has handled adversity, I don't think any other team in the country has been through what we've been through. Um, and we've taken a bunch of hits. But the thing about us is we've always bounced back. Um, I mean, it might take a game or two, but we always find the flow and we always find a rhythm. Um, and just the way we've sort of adapted to the hands that or the cards that they, that have been dealt to us, um, it was just awesome to see and just for me to get back and just try to incorporate myself back into the flow of what they've already built. So, I mean, just the way we've handled adversity has been really inspiring. Thanks. Any, any reservations, you know, mentally of getting back there and trying to do the things you did? And, and what do you think about AZ stealing the show tonight? I think, uh, I mean, I'm just trying to do what I can to help this team win. And just, I'm not really focused about me and getting back to the old me and sort of just doing what I did before because we're such a different team now. So whatever my team needs me to do, I'm going to try to do it. And AZ... Yeah, she's cool. She's cool. She's nice. She's a great shooter. She she did her thing tonight. I'll let her have it. Easy. I think you made your first five shots, and then Paige came in. She threw you the ball and shot and missed. Uh, did she let you just know? like old times? <laughs> did, did she let you know about that? And just more seriously, just what was did it mean to you and the teammates to have her back on the court? Surprisingly, she actually did not let me know about that, but she makes sure to let me know every day in practice anytime I miss and she passes it. Um, but um, I really think that we've had a different kind of energy about us since Paige has been back. And today there was just so much more like excitement and stuff going into this game, knowing that all 11 of us here were healthy and playing. Um, it was a lot of fun to play. I mean, that first sub group when four people subbed in at a time, I was just kind of weird looking, <laughs> but it was a lot of fun today for sure. Paige, welcome back. Um, how did you know, Coach made it sound like maybe over the last week you finally started to realize you were ready to go and ready to be back on the court. But was there a moment for you or a certain stretch where you realized it was go time? Um, yeah, no, it was, my doctors have been telling me, like, you're fully healed, your bones good, your ligaments are good. But it was more of me just being mentally ready um, to use my knee again to make these same cuts, same movements. And so it was just over the past week or so, um, I think shoot around has given me a lot of confidence, just busting up the starters and stuff. So I think uh, AZ knows, AZ knows. <laughs> but no, I think ever since then, like I started actually like thinking about how I felt ready and I felt a lot better in my movements. And I think over the past couple of weeks, um, it's just been a, a lot of confidence for me. Okay, you talked a lot last year that you admitted you would get nervous before a game. I'm just wondering if today was a different kind of nervous at all or a different kind of feeling and what were you going through in you know the hours you know this afternoon leading up to coming here for the game? Yeah, I was nervous, but I was just so excited, so happy. Um, I've never been more happy to be on minutes restrictions. So just to see my name in a box score with minutes next to it, it's just surreal to me, amazing to me just to be back in this position. Um, and I'm just grateful for everything that I have. Yeah, Paige, to kind of actually follow up on Alexa's question, just learning to, I guess, to trust your body when it was time to come back and kind of getting confident in yourself, how difficult or strange was that for you after going through the process? Um, I, I kind of had a situation like that similar to that this summer with my ankle. 
Um, same thing, just being able to trust it. And for a while, I didn't want to go in the paint. I didn't want to rebound. I didn't want to jump anywhere where there's feet where I could land on. So it was the same thing, just mostly for me, it was just cutting and doing lateral movements on defense. Um, but once I got that and once I just sort of told myself and was confident enough to make those movements again, that's when I kind of knew. Full strength finally for the first time since December. What was that like and, and knowing the potential that this team has? Go ahead. No, I've been talking the whole time. <laughs> it's your first media in two months. Go ahead. Take away. <laughs> Freshman duty, let's go. Um, well, um, I would say it was really exciting and fun to have everyone out tonight, but just to think about like, We've dealt with all of our injuries, knock on wood. So hopefully from here, like, we all stay healthy and we keep building on this. I think that's really exciting. That, that's what I'm thinking about, just building on this and how good we're going to be to come. Yeah, I obviously think the vibe is different um, just with everybody's confidence and the way that different people will have to step up. I think Coach said there was, like, 12 different starting lineups. So, I mean, everybody knows their role now and just has a whole bunch of confidence. And when you can see it on the floor, and it's just a lot of fun to play. Daisy, you, you probably knew this question was coming, but does that, uh, what you saw tonight, does that fit your description of nasty? Uh, not yet. Not yet. We're going to get better. Thank you, guys. We'll have a Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.